Hey everyone, in this video we're going to take a look at the Heroic Games Launcher. Heroic is an open source game launcher that can launch games from GOG, Epic Games, and most recently added Amazon Prime Gaming. This will allow you to install games from these stores without having to use their individual game launchers. A big shout out to Jay Fishin for the video idea and for consistently helping make this channel better. What's up Jay Fishin? So Heroic just got a huge update that now allows it to work directly with the Apple Game Porting Toolkit. That means if you have the toolkit already installed on your Mac, running games is as simple as launching Heroic, choosing a game, and choosing the Apple Game Porting Toolkit method of running it. Let's take a look at how it's done. So first things first, I'm going to log into the three different game stores. Next, I'm going to go to my library and let's try the Amazon game store first. If you have a Prime account, that'll give you access to free games every week. Let's try to run Once Upon a Jester. Once a game is added, it likely won't appear in your library right away. If this is the case, try quitting Heroic, waiting about a minute, and then relaunching. To install the game, I'm going to select it and hit install. Next, the Heroic install window will pop up. Give it a minute to process. You'll know it's ready when the install button appears. Under Wine version, select the method of Wine you would like to use to run the game. I want to try it with the game porting toolkit, so I'm going to leave it as is. Once installed, hit the play button to launch. Note that sometimes it takes up to a minute for the game to open. Uh oh, looks like we've got an error. Usually this means we should try a different method of running the game, but let's see what happens if we hit OK. And look at that, the game launches no problem. Uh, why are you wearing that? What do you mean? You can wear that, we just stole it. Doesn't mean we can enjoy its cashmere goodness until then. What do you expect will happen when they see you wearing the missing cashmere scarf? That I bought a cashmere scarf? It's a one-of-a-kind cashmere scarf, Sok! You're getting us caught! I stole it fair and square, Jester. Take a walk. <coughs> Next, let's check out the Epic Game Store. The Epic Game Store is notorious for not being compatible with Crossover, making it very difficult to run games. Heroic is a great workaround for this. Take note that some games from the Epic Game Store still require the Epic Game Store launcher to play the game through Heroic. These games will be marked as not supported in your game's library. You can also check by going to the game store, selecting the game you want, and if you scroll down, under specifications, check the login section. If it requires EA Origin account, that means we're out of luck. So, friend of the channel, Jay Fishin, told me that Severed Steel is a great game to try from the Epic Game Store. Let's see how it runs. When trying to launch, if you get this message that the selected version of Wine can't be found, hit yes. Thanks for watching. If you found this video tutorial helpful, please consider subscribing to help the channel grow. See you in the next video, and keep on gaming on that Mac.